What's up, YouTubers? Hardworker12 with you here today, sitting in a 2020 Subaru Ascent with the EyeSight Assist Monitor. Not to be confused with the EyeSight Driver Assist System or the Driver Monitoring System. The EyeSight Assist Monitor is those blinky lights right there that are sort of a head-up display that show up um, low on the windshield right in the driver's field of vision. So today I'm going to show you what those lights do, how they work. I'm going to put my seatbelt on and we're going to get started. So the red lights that pop up in the middle right there warn you that there is a vehicle in front of you or some sort of obstacle that you're about to hit. So if you see the red ones and hear the beeping, that means stop. When you set your adaptive cruise control, the single green light in the middle of the screen tells you that you are locked onto a target and you are cruising. So I'm locked on the white car in front of me and that one green light is telling me that I'm locked on and I am cruising. So my adaptive cruise control is currently active but not locked on. Now it's locked and it gave me the green light as soon as it locked onto the other car. I don't even know how well that's showing up on the camera, but that's what it means. One green light in the middle means adaptive cruise control is locked on. Now, if you get the yellow lights on the edges, which may have just shown up on my screen, what they mean is that you are over the line, either for the lane departure warning, if it's only blinking on one side, or the lane sway warning, if it's on both sides. So the yellow lights on the side mean lane departure warning. So basically that is the uh, EyeSight Assist Monitor, head up display, blinky lights, whatever you wanna call it. Just to recap, the red ones mean you're gonna hit something, hit the brakes. The green one means you're locked onto the car in front of you for the adaptive cruise. And the two yellow ones on the side if those light up, it means that you're either departing your lane unintentionally or you are swaying in your lane and you need to correct your course. I'm going to try to set that off one more time. There it is. Lane departure warning. Anyway, ooh, there's a C3 Corvette. Beautiful. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And if you didn't enjoy the video, also please like and subscribe. I'll make the next one better. Thank you. Bye-bye.